Please pick a hero. I didn't kill. Hey guys, sometimes in some games, there are some OP heroes that don't get banned. In this case, they left Valentina open, and since I haven't been able to play her at all, because she's often unavailable, well, I just decided to pick her. But to be honest, I think she's a really great mage, but not insanely OP. I thought I could easily dominate Chang Wu at the start of the game, but I guess the buff she received from the latest update is really good. I might have to try her next. And come suffering, the betrayer, or the when there's a good chance to delay the jungler's farm, always go for it. They are playing quite aggressively, but their team composition is not that amazing for that kind of playstyle. Only Hylos is great for the early aggression, their Chang'e doesn't have ult yet, so she cannot contribute much in that kind of play. Interesting. So that's how one wants old without any attack speed items. Even time. It seems like the best ult I can copy from them is probably Screw's ult. My skills are on cooldown, gotta retreat a bit first and wait until they change target. We are outnumbered at the moment, we cannot pursue any further. Since I have only played Valentina when she was just released, I forgot that she used quite a good amount of mana. I should have built the mana shoes instead.
mistakes have we made? I should have dashed towards the first turret instead. This horse only moves forward. It's important to know when they chase too far and retreat. I gotta make sure to copy Glue's old and not Chang O, or I will be doomed. It's funny how Chang'e keeps walking right next to Alucard and sharing the damage. I didn't know that Valentina will inherit all Glue's skills after copying him. That's weird, because if I'm not mistaken, with other heroes, Valentina can only copy their ults. I'm wondering if that's a bug. The only target I want to hold is Clue. It's important to drag the skill instead of just tapping it and letting it auto choose. The only way I can survive from this situation is by copying one ones old. Valentina's ult is really versatile. It can be used for offense or defense depending on the situation. I don't mind leading the pack. 
I definitely could have made a lot more aggressive plays, but for someone who hasn't played her at all since her release, it's very obvious that Valentina is a very strong mage. So whenever she's available, don't hesitate to pick her.